Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, I wanted to go ahead and uh, answer a question that was asked on my YouTube channel. And this particular individual wanted um, to know how they would go about finding sellers for lease option properties. So how do you find motivated sellers uh, for these real estate leads for lease options? And so let me give you some tips. Uh, number one would be the for rent section of Craigslist. And so what you want to do is go ahead and go into the for rent section and find people that are in there that are renting their houses. Oftentimes people are renting because they can't sell for some reason. Um, in this market, who knows, it is a seller's market. But lots of times sellers, there are some sellers who are asking too large of a price for their properties. Um, and then there's some people who are just interested in just renting at this point in time. Uh, whatever the case may be, check out the for rent section of Craigslist. Uh, there are a lot of people um, that are renting their houses, their townhomes, their condos. Um, uh, the townhomes and condos, you kind of want to pay attention to the, to the association a little bit, but stick to houses. Stick to your three and four bedroom houses. That's your best bet, okay? Um, number two, and this is a tip I put in another video. Go to Craigslist, and in the garage sales section, I want you to type in moving sale. Moving sale. Uh, these are people that are moving, okay? And some of them don't have a real estate agent. And investors are not targeting these individuals. Moving sale. Chances are, um, actually, it is a Saturday. And uh, maybe if I get this video out quick enough, some of you can go ahead and target some leads. I typed in moving sale uh, in Craigslist in um, Houston, Texas. And then I typed it in in Charlotte, North Carolina. <laughs> and I was just playing with it. If you are in these two areas... Uh, you got plenty of leads, okay? So, it's a lot of lease option leads out there. Um, a lot of subject to leads. But this is all numbers, guys. So, go ahead and play the numbers. Um, third third thing is uh, do the same thing as moving sale, but then type in estate sale. Estate sale. A lot of these people don't have a real estate agent that's been appointed to the property. Okay? A lot of these people don't have uh, investors that are targeting these properties, you target them. You contact whatever part of the country you're in. Craigslist is a phenomenal tool, but people use it backwards oftentimes. Well, I wouldn't say backwards, but everybody does the we buy a house, we buy. You don't have to do that. You know, just, just spin it. And you go ahead, you type in a specific keyword, and then you bring that keyword out, like estate sale. And just go ahead and either you can go ahead and call the estate sales. Uh, there's going to be addresses because they want to know. Uh, they want you as a general public to know that they're having an estate sale today. Hmm. Sound like a mailing lead as well. Um, oftentimes they'll have phone numbers. Give them a call. You know, so that's number three. Uh, number four would be in Craigslist as well as Google. I want you to type in services in Craigslist okay type in services and then what you can do is um, uh, look for the moving companies these companies that are moving people uh, it's great to develop relationships with moving companies why do I say that they help people that are moving right so sometimes these people are moving from uh, properties that are rental properties. Well, what's the address of that rental property? That address is attached to a owner. Maybe that owner is motivated to go ahead and and do a um, either a subject to or a lease option. Good idea, right? Um, moving companies are a great lead source uh, to target uh, people that are 
motivated. You know what I mean? Lots of times these people don't have, um, people can be moving. I remember I had a situation in the past, um, where a moving company was called for me and somebody I was dating at the time <laughs> years ago. Um, but we were essentially being evicted. Yes. It was all bad. All bad. But the moving company came and they packed us up. Okay. So, hey, um, moving companies. Last thing is going to be a very interesting um, lead source that not a lot of people talk about. If you live near a military base anywhere throughout the country, I want you to think about targeting military bases. There are people that are in the military that are being deployed all the time, right? Um, some of them are being relocated. Think about that. There's a lot of people, a lot of people in the military that live off base. Some of these people can't sell. But you can help them with a creative solution to that problem. Target military bases. Let them know that you can go ahead. And how would you go about doing that? Um, you can actually get in contact with the local military base there, wherever it's located in your area. Number one. Number two, you can create some articles in that specific area. So let's say, for instance, it's, uh, I, you know, I remember in California, uh, there's a military base out there. Uh, it's near Oceanside, California. And, um, the, the, I don't know if it's San Onofre, something of that nature, but there's a military base out there in Oceanside, beautiful area in San Diego County. Love that area. But there's a military base out there where you have a lot of individuals that are in the military that live there. Uh, that is a great source, guys. I remember there was a lady, a real estate investor. She was talking about targeting military bases. It was nobody's ever thought of that. It's a beautiful concept, guys. If you live near a military base, you know, um, I would target that. You never know what you'd come up with. So articles, uh, videos locally on YouTube. And contact the military bases. Let them know that if they can't sell, that you have a solution to whatever issue that they have. And then talk to them and create a win-win situation, either a subject to or a lease option. Beautiful. It's a great source of cash flow, guys. So those are five things that you can utilize to find motivated sellers for your properties, for your lease option deals, okay? All right. Have a good one.